Welcome to the channel. We are getting ready to start hiding some cables, man. Well, I don't know. I wouldn't say hide them. But we're going to run them. I'm going to start disconnecting all these. Uh, it's going to be, it isn't going to be too difficult of a job. I've got four here. I've got a total of eight cameras. There's two in the front and I believe two, three there. So I have drilled a hole right here because my desk uh, I know it's hard to see with this white background. My desk is going to be about right here and I'm going to have the video camera sitting right here. So I'm going to find a plate. I, sh I was in the store today and I didn't look. Uh, hopefully I can get all the wires through that hole. I don't want to make it any bigger than it has to be. That way when I put my board on I can cut that out. Uh, the, the bead board. So anyway, I'm going to start in the front. Those are the ones that have the longest. And I'm going to run everything along this wall up here in the eaves. I've got some little snap brackets that I can put two at a time and nail them in. I want to get them neat looking where they're out of the weather. And then we're going to feed them through here. And hopefully I got enough that I can feed them over to the DVR until I get this office built so I can use them. And then believe me, there's plenty of cable here sorry about the mess i mean that's what's left of it after they're run now so there should be plenty and so like i said i've got a camera on the dog apartment on the outside i've got one on the side of the house here one in the front i have one in the back and one on the side over here one is inside the uh cabin so let's get going man i ain't got time to mess with you we're gonna i'm gonna get the big ladder go up front i gotta take apart that let me show you what i did there i'm keeping keeping you up high because my place is a disaster <laughs> see i drilled a hole through the cabin i've got this wire just hey there's my clothesline yeah let's leave that so i'm gonna take that out of there and run this on the outside along with the other ones uh going out here you see you got one there that is the one i look at the most we got a waldo we got a lily we got a tilly over there we got a rooster and a biscuit with a jacket on and i got one there and then there's one i don't know if you can see it on the side of the dog apartment i'm also going to take this uh cable for the uh cell phone extender and run it the same with the other cables so now this eve needs a lot of work man this roofing you know this is where that piece drew put on for me i don't know how it was on there but it wasn't like that with that overhang so the guy that put my roof on you can see he didn't come out with any kind of overhang he was supposed to come come back and put uh caps on the ends well you can see all this wood now is rotted no good now this is going to need work in the future this whole side of the cabin is just needs work i mean he didn't even he didn't even go far enough in on this so i'm gonna have to fix all this stuff myself but anyway right now we're gonna start running this cable should be a fairly simple task just a little tedious i'll stop in uh along the way you know as i get through it stop in and show you what i've got done all right, man, it's part of the deal. All right, this back is going to be fairly simple. Uh, all, all four back cameras, the dog apartment, the screen patio, the one that's facing the back of the property and the side are all right here. Okay, these are coming from the outside cameras. And what I'm doing is I'm simply going to just drill the hole there. I'm going to go outside there and I'm going to pull them. We're going to bring them around just to there. Then when I get there, I'm going to pull just enough to make it back to the where I currently have the DVR. And then I'm going to, the excess cable, I'm going to tie up and it'll be in the utility closet. So there will be no big wads like that laying on the floor. And this is only going to take a few minutes. And, and those are done. Then I just got this one side cam, or these two cameras to deal with. They're going to be very simple. Uh, I probably end up pulling them out. Yeah, all I got to do there is just tack them up, pull them out, shove them in the hole. So that's going to work out good. All right, let's go outside and get this done. 
okay so there's those four wires coming into here i'm going to bring them up run them along that two by four run them straight down here or straight here and then under this eave and then straight down and i've got some cable ties that'll make that look real nice uh i need to get this crap cut off here this old flashing or just what i need to do is push it down tack it down with something this is uh, it's got to be addressed but this isn't going to get any weather in here especially once that door shut off all right so that'll take care of half the cameras all at once and then it's just a matter of bringing this one straight over not too far and then figuring out what to do with this cell phone extender it'll probably go through the same hole then i'm gonna get rid of that hole i need to get the whole side of this thing in order uh and we're gonna do that today uh the main reason i mean i would have done it this way when i did the install of the security system uh it was hot not only that that guy was on my butt every day hey man did you make the video did you make the video did you make the video that's why i don't do a whole lot of these reviews because they send you the product and i understand but man you know there's other things going on so I, i'm trying not to, I, actually i got three of them to do yet i'm gonna get to that this week i hope but uh yeah i don't like to be pressured into getting something done i do not you know that ain't my life you know i like unfinished things all right guys let's get this done all right the morning's good and the way i say it, say it's good is because i found my hammer that's always good here's what i got well you can just snap one on each side and nail it in i was looking for something that had more of a four or five at a time but they didn't have anything like that so we'll do with what we got Right, fight my way into this mess. If this will even open in here. Alright. We need to start it. Okay. It's small in here. Alrighty then. Let's grab a couple of these. Let me see, I didn't read the package. So, if I'm in California, which I'm not, I probably shouldn't put them in my mouth. <laughs> I like making fun of you guys, I'm sorry. All right, up we go. Let's just stretch her straight up, like yonder. Now, what nail I do, do you? Well, how do these work? Let me see. You get two together. I got straight dog issues. I don't know if these are going to work. Oh, yeah, they'll work. I'll drop one. Alright, so we're going to go like that and that. This could be bigger. Why wow, they make worth a crap? Gotta get something else. I knew I should have bought something else. These ain't big enough. Uh, and then I got these dogs coming on the property. I am an angry man already. Most irresponsible people in the world. They live on this road. All right, I'm gonna go get this regular cable ties, I guess. Get out of here. All right, it's some time later. I've got six cables, but the front cameras are gonna remain, the cables will remain inside there. But, uh, the camera on the doghouse, I'm moving it. I don't get a good picture there. Nothing, all the dog houses are in the way from where I have it now. So right now I'm just going to run this one back to that camera. That's a good spot. And these all are run. I'll show you what I did with those in a minute. Uh, biggest 
time consuming thing is fighting the length of the cables, man. But we're gonna get these tacked on here. Then I can get, get on Amazon, see if I can find, or I'll make a plate to cover these holes, make them look good. All right, man, I'll be back when I get more done, because I ain't got more done right now. All right, I'm by far no professional at wire running. Those are the six, six of the eight cameras, and I'm gonna cover that hole, don't worry. But I got the one up front, it's run up top. Once I pull the slack out of it, I won't have that. I ran out of these little cable ties, so that camera's all hooked up, and then I moved this one it was on the front there and I moved it there. I'll be able to get a better view because these dog houses, that's all I saw before and a little bit of the yard, but now I'll be able to catch that whole area. Uh, and you know, when I put a door on and then these, I'm gonna secure better once, they're just running here. I put extra length so I can hook it up now and use it now, but all the slack will be taken up back here later and put somewhere and you won't see it so better in the way it was and now i think i'm just gonna unhook the cell phone extender because i don't think i even need it anymore because i use wi-fi because i got starlink so uh somebody i'm gonna test it i'm gonna unhook it and call somebody and uh if i don't need it anymore i'm gonna get rid of it and somebody needs it i'll give it to them because somebody gifted that to me and i'll gift it to somebody it worked when i needed it but when I got Starlink, I don't think there's a need for it anymore. Uh, maybe if I'm out on the property, I don't, it really didn't never work outside, you know, because the antenna's inside, but I don't think I need it. So I'm gonna get rid of that. And I'm gonna be back. Okay. <laughs> oh man, did I mess up. I got everything run, you know. Got them up there out of the way so I can work. But you know what? I forgot to put the piece of wall board up. <sighs> yeah, it won't be no big deal. I just unhook it right here. I moved, I moved the system right here so it doesn't have far to pull. <laughs> Man, why'd I do that? <sighs> That's all right. I got the cell phone extender. I got that out of here. I don't need it. So if anybody needs that, let me know i'll mail it to you uh, shipping will be on me if somebody can use it yeah i got wi-fi so it doesn't i don't need it i did make a few test calls hey i probably haven't been using it all along but so now i just gotta i still got a buttload of this cable so i'm just gonna tie it up and plug it in there and then <laughs> probably tomorrow undo it again so i can put this piece of wall up i may come up with a unique way to put that in there I don't know man why did I do that oh well it just it'll take 15 minutes to redo no problem so what the deal is is when when my desk is here here's the hole I'll just roll all these up uh, and you know they'll be hidden behind the deal and they'll plug in right here so all of them except for the two in the front and I'm gonna those are going to stay inside. I got to hide those in the house. So that's what we did for today. And uh, I, this is, I don't even want to say, this is ground wire for this. <laughs> I need to get the proper wire. I didn't have the big ground wire for this. It's a sub panel. That one is grounded with the proper grounding wire, but I know this one should probably be too. So tomorrow I'll go get the proper ground wire, run it right. This was all I had, so I doubled it up. To make the thickness the same i think it was an eight gauge or something like that i don't know it's worked but i want to get that done right get all this cleaned up boxed in as you can see i originally had a i've got it designed where i can cover this with a piece of board i don't know where that board went get this thing stuck i don't know why that come unglued uh, and then get a uh, a panel a box built around this i'll make that look cool and I still got to notch those and shove those up out of the way. And then we can go nuts on this room, man, because everything's out of the way. Now, that's not going to be there. Like I said, they'll be rolled up uh, and kept back here. Now, I did those ones that were out there are now like this. So they're out of the way. So now I can insulate this, uh, cover that hole, fill that hole up. 
because none of them will need to be moved and if they are it's no big deal to bust that foam out i had to do it there so all right man i'll come back if i got anything else look here brand spanking new even got that tissue paper you use that as toilet paper you know it's uh, ain't nothing wrong with it why they call it tissue paper look at them babies mm -hmm. arch fit it says mm-hmm I, I bet your cousins ain't got them sketchers yeah pretty good shoes wear them the sunday go to meeting man 